Black Light Back. Uh, speaking on those uh, in, uh, vampire, uh, energy vampires and false prophets and trickery and however way you want to put it. Uh, we was in theologians and uh, talking about that was theologians uh, nine and uh, verse nine. We started from verse nine, ended up at fifteen or fourteen. So. I don't know how many more of these I'm going to put out today, but, you know, I might be hitting some of y'all oops upside the head with this book right here. Now, we, we, uh, the first one we made of this, we say, uh, I could be a, a Muslim and teach uh, Christianity. See, what y'all don't understand is, that the Quran is a backup for these two it's two books well there's a lot of books in here but you got the Old Testament and the New Testament mostly everybody now is in the New Testament they don't have too much deal with the Old Testament and when you see a Christian uh, tell you that Islam ain't cool and what I mean ain't cool let me let me break it down so y'all can break properly when they tell you that Islam is the enemy of Christianity they're lying there's been a lot of examples even in these modern day times when uh, in a country say like in Iraq uh, under Saddam Hussein's regime uh, they had Christians over there they had uh, Serbs over there they had uh, Jews all of them living the, the same you know and they all practiced or uh, did what they thought they was practicing they name brand religions but they was practicing the same thing because they all spoke Arab and they called um, the most high Allah all of them did the Christians called Allah because they speak an old school original language that came from that uh, developed from ancient what y'all call Egypt just like they changed the name of Egypt from from Mayat, I mean from uh, Kemet to uh, e Egypt, they changed the name of Africa from it's Greek, you know. Whoever was ruling, they changed the uh, wording, you know, from its original. That's why we call ourselves, instead of the black man and uh, any other label you want to put on people of melanin, we call ourselves in the nation of Islam, or those that were taught in the nation of Islam, say we are the original man, the aboriginal man. The Asiatic black man. See, that covers all what we used to be called in ancient times. Because in modern times, they start calling us uh, Negroes and uh, Coons and Niggas and all the other uh, labels. Now we call African Americans. You know? So, all this is through trignology. Now, I want to jump over here to the 
Vatican and tell you this. I'm talking to the black man right now. If you look at the Vatican or Vatican Rome, it's a nation, a city nation. Got its own everything happening. You know, everything is a nation. So, let's jump back to uh, here in America. Now, the Vatican is a nation to itself. It's not Italy. It's Vatican city nation or state nation. Now, they got a whole lot of wealth over there and they people bring money to them. It's so commercialized, it's, it's the same. Now, let's jump back over here to the black man that practice Christianity. Cat, uh, the Catholic religion is the father of Christianity. You know, because it was called something Jesus was Jesus never did term his what he was teaching Christianity. So, or know that y'all, well, we gonna call him Jesus because y'all used to Jesus, but we gonna say Jesus or either Isa. He didn't teach in no church, even though he called out the church. And when he called the church out in Revelation. That don't mean it was a building. But I want you to notice one thing. He called out uh, churches. Let me, let me try to find revelations right quick. Because time, time is moving, boy, in those 15 minutes. You know, time slot. But uh, he was calling out these churches. And it says... Uh, Alpha and Omega and the first and the last what thou seest write it a book and send it unto the seven churches which are in Asia now when uh, the seven churches in Asia now we're not talking about those Asians that you call Asians nowadays like the Chinese and uh, those other Asians uh, over there, we're not talking about those. That's the earth. The Asian was by the teachers of the most honorable Elijah Muhammad. That's what he called it. He said, We the Aboriginal Asiatic black man. Asiatic mean the whole earth was called Asia at that time, you know. And Jesus is confirming that what he said is true. He said that uh, the book and send it to the seven churches which are in Asia. You know? Asia period, not East Asia. The whole planet or the whole uh, earth or where they was at at that time was Asia. Not Arabia, you know. It was called not the Middle East. That was Asia. And the whole the messenger said the Bible Elijah Muhammad said the whole planet was called Asia. So misinformation and miseducation guides your footsteps. You're going to miss a step every time when you get miseducated and miss uh, information. You're going to miss a step. And every time you miss a step, you know, you get left behind. So that's where we at now, you know. So all everybody is being frauded under the illusion of this fiat dollar.
So no one is truthful. Priest is not telling you the truth. Because we're going to go into, uh, on the next video, we're going to go into uh, uh, the rich man, the young rich man, uh, and then we're going to go into about how they try to use trickery on Jesus, talking about the, those taxes. And if you talk to all the uh, church people right now, they paying taxes. And uh, they say, you're supposed to pay taxes. You say, why? Because Jesus said, you know, they tell you that you don't pay attention to what, what you don't know how to read, how to read this, this Bible here, the scriptures. You don't know how to read it. He said, give unto Caesar what belongs to Caesar. That's like saying, give the Federal Reserve back they money because you know they stole they stole the United States money even though the black man never was a citizen of the United States but I'm speaking up for you for you uh, ignorant uh, white people y'all go to church too you know y'all get game ran on you too y'all suckers too by these kind men cause when Jesus said Give back Caesar what belongs to Caesar and give unto God what belongs to God. Well, Caesar stole your money and then stopped making his own money. And you give it back to him anyway. Because every time you spend, it goes back to him, the Federal Reserve. Which is over there in the in Vatican, all of them connected. The Vatican, the Federal Reserve, you know, all of them is the inner circle or the inner workings of that which we call the Illuminati, but AKA Satan. Satan deceived the whole world, see? Hey man, we crushing y'all on YouTube, man. All y'all wanna think y'all got y'all got game. You ain't got nothing. You know, I don't pay attention to to the to these uh, numbers on these views and whatever. Even though they uh, tell me, uh, then we we catch you, we won't let you copyright, won't let won't let you be aired over there or viewed over there in certain countries. I ain't gonna check and see what countries that don't want to view me. You know, but uh, you know. That's when I know that uh, I'm hitting hard, you know. So this is Black Light, and we're going to close this one down and post it. And the day is, what, it's 128. Oh, I might can make a couple. I don't spend all day because uh, uh, I'm fasting, and I got to be ready. I'm going to be, I'm kind of hungry. I was out there shoveling snow, you know, it's snowing up here and, uh, the woods, you know, by the lake, and supposed to get 10 inches a day, and I got to do some more shoveling, I went out there and shoveled the driveway, the sidewalk, you know, so this is black light, we're going to come back, look for us, with a, maybe a couple of more then, we're going to shut this one down, but we still going to be kicking some supreme wisdom.